So this is just a quick step on uh, the quick and easy Stirling engine assembly instructions. We've made our displacer piston and we've inserted the, the displacer push rod that's going to be in there. And we need to attach it with some high temperature epoxy. I'm using JB Quick. It's a five minute epoxy that will handle relatively high temperature. We don't need very much for this step. We mix equal parts from each tube. Be careful when you put them out there that you don't get epoxy on the tip of the wrong tube and stir that together. Now we're going to put this on the edge of that wire. Set that aside in about five minutes. That'll be all cured and ready to go.